Rito and Goldar drop the Zeo Crystal, the Rangers drop down a hole, and Rita and Zed drop and run. Alpha, Zordon, and the Rangers are all back in action and fighting brand new Sentai footage. The Rangers test their new Zords, Bulk and Skull test their new bike, and Tanya tests her new boyfriend. Because a quiz game programmed by high schoolers is totally viable software for a mechanical monster. Tommy and Cat borrow a baby and teach it a totally justified fear of robotic clowns. Tanya learns she can throw a softball and then throws away her verbally abusive boyfriend. A dog helps save a former cat. Irony! Stop using robotic clowns to mess with children, Machine Empire. That's just wrong. Still a smoother filming experience than the last movie the Rangers worked on. Billy accidentally graduates just in time to be summoned to an aquatic world. Beach party? Nice leaves. And your branches aren't too bad either. Skull's a virtuoso on the piano. Who knew? That's not how viruses work, and this is not Superhuman Samurai Cyber Squad. Zordon Alpha and the Rangers play Pong with King Mondo using Billy's spaceship. Tommy gets dumped by Kim while the rest of the town falls in love with their household appliances. Tommy gets a new skiing instructor, and things heat up, largely due to accelerated global warming. King Mondo ruins Tommy's chance of a very intimate VR Troopers crossover. Tommy meets a guy like the guy that gave him the non-plot relevant arrowhead, and he gets a new Zord. Adam learns boxing! Uh, no, wait, this is another episode about Tommy finding himself. Okay, so the airhead was key to finding his long-lost brother, so I guess it's kind of relevant. Tommy saves his brother and the arrowhead, just in time for them to have no bearing on future episodes. Even that blind girl could have told you not to trust that evil robot monster. Rita and Zed are back! Oh no, wait, it's just a dream. I guess that'll never happen. Bulk's romantic advances get Lieutenant Stone fired. Wait. Tanya's second best known musical performance. The one that doesn't hurt. Invisibility in a martial arts tournament? Totally not suspicious. Divide and conquer. Novel concept. Also, new ranger with giant pyramid right out of nowhere. Deserts, spiders, bite-sized rangers, and bulk and skull go looking for... Gold? Tommy and Cat get married after Dino Thunder to have grandkids and tell them tales about tolerance. Cat, Tommy, and his brother David go surfing and face contamination by... Black Gold? Better not get caught sleeping or else... I'm too tired for more allusions to gold. Invisible Pyramid, Mysterious Ranger, Mysterious Bounty Hunter, and a missing dog to boot. Is it Billy? Skull? David? Nope! Alien triplets. Well, one of those three must be the replacement Gold Ranger. No? Jason? How? Brand new Super Zeo Megazord blows up King Mondo. I guess this is the end. Rita and Zed? Rita and Zed send over a sentient bomb to take over the Machine Empire. This can only go well. A giant wheel falls out of the sky, everyone gets a little bit stinky, and it's pronounced stenchois. Tanya's parents have been stuck looking for a useless bonus ally for a long, long time. Trust the Midas touch. I actually don't, especially if there's a magic dog statue involved. Gasket and Archerina show up, Louis Kaboom goes boom, and this episode has nothing to do with Rocky. Nashville to Norway, Bonaire to Zimbabwe, Chicago to... Actually, he's just been captured. Tommy's convinced he's the king and savior of the universe. Doesn't seem to take that much either. The day is saved when the rangers demorph and are rescued by Rita, Zed, Bulk, and Skull. Really? Tommy's messed up brain spots time loops. Also, Tommy's messed up brain spots time loops. Cat out detectives the detectives in detecting the detective. Let's stop this crime, it's morphin' time, Beethoven's fifth and rhyme. Rita, Zed, and Mondo are all back in the game, while Billy's getting way too old for this. The alien rangers are back to save the day, while Billy leaves to get young marrying a fish. Tommy, you're just now figuring out that Cat might like you? Also, there's a luau or something. Jason gives his powers back to Trey, who grows the rangers big, who punch out King Mondo, who gets blown up by Rita and Zed, and what happens now? Find out next time.